remember, uh, so like Dallas high school, ba- this is random, but uh, Dallas high school basketball, remember that uh, Thanksgiving hoop fest thing? Yeah. They would have every November. Guess mm-hmm. who's going to be playing in that uh, upcoming year? Who? Uh, Bronny James. Really? <laughs> I just, I, I just. The streets bruh. told me that, yeah. So I got a message from the homie, and he was sent. He sent out an uh, Eventbrite to that, and oh, I was okay. like, "No, nah, I don't want to go." But I didn't know Bronny James was playing. Yeah, I kind of want to see what he got. I mean, you think LeBron <laughs> gonna be here? You think LeBron gonna be here? Well, I think so because I mean that's like during Thanksgiving, like it's the day after Thanksgiving, and so like, of course, you want to be with your family. But that's in season. Yeah, that's true too. If he doesn't have any like games during mm-hmm. that time, I mean, I feel like he, especially like if he has like a Southwest game, like a mm-hmm. in the Texas area. Mm-hmm. I mean, definitely gonna have to hold on, check to see what the Lakers schedule is looking like right now. <laughs> that be LeBron James, even though I don't like LeBron, you know, I mean, he's it's LeBron James. I mean, come on. Now. <laughs> I guess. Uh, yeah, I'm actually looking it up too. Um, but uh, what was it? Just for the people at home, I just want people at home to know, like, I have a love-hate relationship for LeBron James or a feeling for LeBron James. Mm-hmm. Um, even though I don't like him, I still support him as a businessman, as a, a philanthropist. But as far as basketball goes, <laughs> I haven't liked him since he tr- he took himself to South Beach, as in his own words. He took his talents to South Beach. I haven't liked him since. Mm-hmm. Um, but if he's somewhere, I mean, I, even as a LeBron hater, I can't not be there. So yeah. you can think I'm phony. I don't know what you want to think, but that's me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Kobe Bryant, Todd Doc. <laughs> whatever. I had to throw that in there. You know I had to throw that in and there. And I'll throw, I'll throw in Kobe's not a top 10 player of all time. I'll just we're throw not, that in there. If you can, <laughs> if you can, we're not going this direction, Sha. Si. Without this what? Is it's because if we go in that direction, we'll be on this thing all day. Yeah, it's too late, it's too late for that. And we have to have, too like, late. somebody else here. Um, but He's so definitely a top 10 player of all time. All like, right. All right. Whatever, whatever. Um, so I'm looking at the yeah. schedule. Uh-huh. Um, so, I remember, he'll actually be pretty close. Um, so Thanksgiving's that Thursday. Wait. Right. have games during those situations. Uh, so that Friday and Saturday afterwards during, he has games on both those days. But the Friday, oh, game, okay. Friday game is at, uh, in Oklahoma City and the Saturday game is in Memphis. Are we yes. looking at the same schedule? Yeah. November 22nd. Okay. November 23rd. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. I got you. I got you. Yeah. Oklahoma City. I wonder if he's like going to be playing like, because you know, um, what they have a lot of out of state high school teams as well. I wonder mm-hmm. it'd be cool if Brownie was playing like Dallas Lincoln or something like that. That'd be like, yeah. Kind of cool. <laughs> it's just a random public high school. Yeah, I mean they'll watch them though. Let's be honest. Yeah. Dallas Lincoln ain't that good. The only yeah, I mean, I, they were good I back in the day. That was, yeah, that's back in that's back in the day. Yeah, that's when I first was into like high school basketball. Yeah, that's but, when uh, high school basketball started to pop. Yeah, especially in Texas. Especially um, in Texas, yeah. But, but uh, I think IMG probably will be here. Um, yeah. I wonder if um, Oak Hill is going to be here mm. or Mount Vernon. I don't know. We're not that big. Um, I mean, we're big enough for Bronny James. I mean, we're, we're talking about LeBron James. Yeah, that was – that was, like, really – like, one of my friends was talking about that. I want to try to look at the schedule here real quick. I wonder if they have it, like, online. Uh, How much it costs? Not that much. Are you gonna go or are you gonna be in Lubbock? Uh let's see. Um 
I will be in – I mean, I'll probably be in Dallas. Well, okay, so actually I'm looking at the schedule. So this is weird. They're having the Thanksgiving uh, – Okay, so I got Thanksgiving wrong. I think I was looking at the wrong year. Um, so it's the yeah. 20, uh, 28th Thursday. Right, and then he'll be in Washington. Okay, yeah, that's right. Okay, so that uh, Hoop Fest was 29th through the 30th. Um, oh, okay. So he might – I mean, he got a Dallas game on the on the 1st of December. He might fly in early. Interesting. I mean – um, During the 29th and 30th. Yeah, so if they if he if Brunny plays on the thirtieth, he might fly in that Saturday because he got that game on on because they might they might come in because they come from Washington, so they might come in early right after that game in Washington that okay. Saturday, and then you know I don't know how that works. Yeah, uh, so it's possible that LeBron James is going to be in Dallas, Texas. Yeah, true, true. Yeah, so Brunny's a freshman in high school, and I also forgot Dwayne Wade's son <laughs> is on that oh, yeah, team too, Zaire. Yeah, uh, they played for the same team. Yeah. And Dwayne Wade's retired, so I'm I'm assuming he's definitely gonna be there maybe. Yeah. Uh that's crazy. That's too big, big, you know. And, yeah. And to be honest, like Bronny James isn't like like super he's not like a top ten player or anything mm -hmm. yet. Mm -hmm. Uh but Zaire Wade definitely is like he's oh, definitely yeah. getting a lot of looks. Like he's, yeah, because of his height and and, and, and his exactly. length, he's like he shot up overnight on the low. Because I remember watching him when I first noticed him; he was real short. But yeah. then, like now, he's like he's got height on him, you know. Yeah. So. So um, they don't have the schedule out right now, uh, mm -hmm. but they said Duncanville will be there because they just won state actually last year. Okay, I didn't know that. Alice Madison, who won state as well last year, so. Uh, Madison, I just was by, I just was at Madison the other day, oh, really? passing by it. I didn't know that team was that good still. Yeah, that was Madison. I didn't realize Duncanville won last year. That was like they they've been kind of going through a rough patch. Yeah, bit, this decade. Yeah. Um, um, yeah. I think they had Perry Jones at one point in time. Yeah, that was like their last good. Team, good team, like right? Twenty ten, right? But uh, that's six A basketball, right? Yeah. Okay.